Will your home pass the test? Can you sell your home for top dollar right now? Or do you need to do a few things to make sure that you get top dollar? Hi, I'm Dana Wild with Coldwell Banker Select, a Wasa Homes and Lifestyle Group. Let's take the quiz to see if your home passes the sell for top dollar test. Our team has sold over a hundred homes, so we know what we're talking about. Here we go. When you walk up to the house, to your home, does it have curb appeal, fresh landscaping, maybe a bit of black bark, fresh flowers, plants or trees, new trim and door paint, or possibly even a new paint job? You need to hire someone who cares more about getting you top dollar than possibly hurting your feelings. Have you done the three Ds? Declutter, depersonalize, and deep clean? And I mean really deep clean. Baseboards, scuff marks, clean up the landscaping, change out old light bulbs, and more. Is your lawn lavish and green or yellow and crispy? Yes, these things matter. Are the walls painted a neutral color? Have you patched holes, painted the front door, and trim? Hey, red brick with mismatched paint does not qualify for selling for top dollar, at least not in this market. Do you have neutral carpets that are clean, or are they 10 years old and have been cleaned 15 times, and once it rains or people walk over them a few times, well, the truth comes out. This isn't going to cut it to get top dollar. Do you have updated flooring and countertops? Are your cabinets still the same as they were 15 years ago, or have you updated them? Does your lot compare to the one half acre lot that is up the street? You see, all of this matters. This is a big one, the smell test. I'm sure you don't realize this, but did you know that most people have a smell to their home? Yes, a smell. I know it sounds gross, but it's true. We love pets. In fact, we have two Australian Shepherds in our home, and we consider them like family. But if I were to list my home, I'd have to clean my carpets and Febreze like crazy. Let's face it, animals have accidents. So when I sell, I have to make changes, and I'd even have to pass the smell test. What about cooking? Do you cook with spices that you are used to, but if someone else came over, it might smell like a fish fry? Again, that's a no-go. Have you truly compared your home to your competition? I mean, everyone, including me, thinks that I have the best home on the block. I mean, listen, I know you may have spent five weeks putting in the old white tiles with brown grout 10 years ago, but will it measure up to your competition? Is your home partially staged or is it fully staged to ensure it shows to the best of its ability? Is your furniture outdated and would it probably look better in grandma's house? Hey, don't shoot the messenger. I'm just trying to help. When you look out the window, are you looking at your neighbors showering or is there a pasture, hills, or waterfront? Yes, I believe it or not, looking at your neighbor's bathroom or hearing them yell over who gets to pick what to watch on TV tonight isn't quite as desirable as having an open view. So I challenge you, take a good long look at your home and if you're ready to put your house on the market, and sell for top dollar, or if you need to make a few changes, we can help. P.S. Most of us have to make a few changes. It took me six months preparing my last home to get ready to sell. We live in our homes, but when it's time to sell, it needs to look like a showroom, and that's where we can help. Please comment below or reach out to us with a private message. This is Dana Wow with Coble Banker Select, a Wasa Homes and Lifestyle Group, where we focus on real estate, relationships, and results.